Today we are going to visit Canon Zashbi. It is the home of the Dryden family, which started life as a Tudor farmhouse and has undergone many alterations over the past 400 years. The garden today is very similar to the original design of 1710 in the time of Edward Dryden. <laughs> Today the house is presented to eco the time of Sir Henry Dryden, the antiquary, who lived at Cannons Ashby from 1837 to 1899. In Sir Henry's time, plenty of space was dedicated to growing a variety of fruit and vegetables.
this court served as the main entrance to the house until 1840 when Sir Henry turfed it over and changed the entrance. Devíamos ir porque a outra segunda-feira não está aberta. É assim que quer me sair da house sem sair ou não? Bora? You want to go in the grass? The interior of the house was very antique. Okay, I was thinking then we come, also you go up and then you go other side, uh, okay.
colinha. Colinha, não devia ninguém. Demove. Só da Epic. Small. Yeah. Tem small chair to sit for them to eat. This is not for the baby, but this is for the, the tall adults, for the kids to play with the dolls. Easy for nursery. Mm -hmm. It's a small uh, room for them to play. <laughs> we have the thing of wood, puzzles of wood. It's a small theater for them to play. This is a small room of the child. Pijama. This is a cat. This is a cat. Correctly. Não é que ele está morto. Mataram. Não é isso não defeito, mas por isso ainda é preservado, tem light. Que a casa é sufocante. Deixa ninguém levar, filho. Não te preocupes. Se levarem, olha. Ai. You have to Vamos por aqui a piquinha, tá bem? Vá, vamos a 
mostrar aqui a fitinha, assim, e toma. Anda cá, anda cá, anda cá. The sundial dates from 1710 and remains a focal point in the vista. The sundial was accurate and actually displayed the correct time. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe and leave a comment. Thank you and bye bye.